welcome! Today, we will learn about active and passive voice. So, what is active voice? Active voice is when a subject acts upon the verb linked to it within the sentence. This is the common voice used in the English language in both writing and speaking. Pengertian dari kalimat aktif yaitu ketika subjek bertindak berdasarkan kata kerja yang terdapat di dalam kalimat. Kalimat aktif ini merupakan kalimat yang umum digunakan di dalam bahasa Inggris, baik dalam menulis maupun berbicara. Next, we have formula. The formula or rumus dari kalimat aktif adalah subject plus verb plus object. Example. I will clean the house every Saturday day. Saya akan membersihkan rumah setiap hari Sabtu. I di sini sebagai subjek, clean sebagai verb atau kata kerja, dan the house sebagai objek. I di situ yang bertindak membersihkan objeknya, yaitu rumah. The next is, what is passive voice? So, The passive voice is used when we want to emphasize the action or the verb and the object of a sentence rather than the subject. Jadi, kalimat pasif digunakan ketika kita ingin lebih menekankan tindakan atau kata kerja dan objek kalimat daripada subjek dari kalimat tersebut. Dengan kata lain, objeknya dikenai tindakan. The formula of the passive voice atau rumus dari kalimat pasif yaitu subject plus to be plus verb three plus by agent example the house will be cleaned by me every saturday the house di sini berperan sebagai subject be sebagai to be cleaned sebagai verb three atau kata kerja lampau bentuk ketiga dan by me sebagai by agent atau pihak yang melakukan. Jadi, di dalam contoh kalimat tersebut, the house atau rumah akan dibersihkan oleh saya setiap hari Sabtu. For more information, so the formulas and examples for active and passive voice that I have explained before actually is used for a present tense sentence. Here, I will show you the example of passive and active voice based by many kinds of tenses. According to my explanation before, the formula for passive voice is subject plus to be plus verb three plus by agent. In this example, you might not find any words by agent. But don't worry, because the agent is the person or thing that performs the action and is the subject of the active sentence. In most passive sentences, the agent is not mentioned. So, if you write or see a passive sentence without adding by agent in the last sentence, it is totally fine. Quiz time! So, I will give you five sentences. You need to choose which one is belong to the active voice and which one is passive voice. In each sentence, you will have three seconds to decide. Let's see how many questions you get it right. Let's begin. So, how many questions you guessed it right? Is it five? Wow, congratulations! Only two? Three? That's okay. You can do it better next time. Our lesson is done for today. See you in the next material and have a great day. Goodbye!